I'm taking Uma. There ain't a... Sergeant Hartle said I could. Bring him back though, won't you? Be awful dull without him. Find something else to laugh at. I don't know, catch some frogs and shove straws up their asses. Huh? <laughs> that one of your Witcher games? Witcher version's different. Don't make me show you. Open the door, now. Hey, little guy. This here's Roach. She'll take us to Kaer Morhen. Well, come on. What the? Quit playing around. Let's go. <sighs> Looks like we got company. Elf Guardian battle mounts. What do you want? The Emperor's displeased with you. Then he ought to ask somebody else for help. The Emperor does not ask anyone for anything. You will ride with us to Vitsima. Sure about that? Don't even try. Fine. Lead the way. And the third army will sweep in from the west to take Banglim. If I may, Your Imperial Majesty, our spies report that the garrison at Banglim consists almost wholly of mercenaries. Bribery, then. We stand to lose exactly no men in battle. And we stand to lose less time. Very well. Give the orders. Then set sail. As you wish. At once! Your Imperial Majesty, Yennefer. I did not have you brought here for an exchange of courtesies. Report. As you wish, Your Majesty. Siri. Well, this. Man is the key to finding her. I give you three solid leads. Trails as fresh as morning dew. The aid of my spies and my court sorcerers. Yet in my daughter's stead, you bring me this... monstrosity? I hope you have more to say. For your sake. Listen, I'm looking for a needle in a haystack. A needle that at any moment can... It's a difficult task, I know this. What of it? Listen to me. I rule the largest empire the world has ever known. I wage a war against the North, command men in tens of thousands, while at home the trade corporations and nobles seek to depose me. You cannot expect me to pity you the difficulty of your task. This monstrosity might well be your daughter. Its body is the product of a curse. Someone hides inside it. Can you lift this curse? I've done a great deal of research, made inquiries, but to lift it I would need to know the words used to cast it, and that... Raphael Elen, 
Kedmil Fali, Gladiv Don Eptened Bandro Ithne Iacus. Dandelion told me. Siri talked to him about it. At last, you provide a pleasant surprise. Lady Yennefer, my question stands. Yes. I believe I can. But I must... Details do not interest me. Geralt, you've achieved precious little, yet admittedly more than the bumblers in my spy corps have. I give you half the promised reward. You will receive the other when you bring me Siri. Wouldn't count on that happening. That was no request, it was an order, Geralt. And I advise you well, do not disobey me. This audience is over. Till the next. So, how do we lift doing this curse? We must take him to Kaer Morhen. Oh, and Geralt, forgive me, but I'm unable to teleport you, Uma, and Roach, so... Don't worry, we'll ride there. Never did like teleporting. Take care of yourself. Wait. Here, probably better if you keep it. Of course. I'm off. His long search for Ciri led Geralt to conclude that Uma, the ugliest man alive and the victim of a curse, was the key to finding the young woman. Geralt needed to lift the curse, so he took Uma to the home of the world's greatest specialist on dark spells, to the Witcher's Fortress of Kaer Morhen. Quite a while. Too long. And your journey, how was it? Calm, if you don't count the forked tail that flew over our heads a few miles back. Passenger got a little restless. Hmm. <laughs> what have we here? Multiple deformities, eyes, ears, nostrils, a hair lip, and is this... <laughs> now, now, calm down. Jennifer was right on one count. Thing sure isn't pretty. Yen's here already. And how? Huh, <laughs> you two argue? Geralt, I understand she's a... Well, how do I put this? Emancipated, strong-willed woman. But do manners count for nothing? She teleports in, not even a nice to see, jumps right into a we've a curse to lift, there's this to do and that. So Eskel and Lambert get going. And she went to the guest room to rearrange things through the bed off the balcony. So where is everyone? Eskel's hunting fork tails. Gotta nip that infestation in the bud. And since Yennefer needs to distill some ingredients from their organs, well, like they say, two birds, one stone. Lambert's still in the keep, preparing to venture into the mountains to enrich the phylactery with elemental power. Mm hmm And Yen? Assembling a megascope. Wanted my help, running around with some chirping contraption, searching for something. 
but I'm too old for that nonsense. I should let her know I'm here. If you say so, but don't go thinking she'll throw her arms around your neck. Decide to blow us up? Geralt, I'm sorry, but I'm in no mood for jests. What's eating you? Let me think. That was the third crystal to explode. It's been a week, and Lambert's still not done what I've asked. Vesemir spitefully insists on repairing the wall just beneath my window and starts hammering at the crack of dawn, while Eskel seems to have gone mushroom picking, not forktail hunting. The guys. Well, they're not exactly happy with you. Hmm. Why is that? Because you aren't willing to say what you're planning. You're treating them like pages, not including them. Us, actually, because I feel that way too. I shall explain everything, when the time is right. First we must finish our preparations. Fine. What do I do? Firstly, help Eskel and Lambert. One was supposed to get me Forktail spinal fluid, the other was to fortify the phylactery with elemental power. I've yet to see anything from either of them. All right, I'll talk to them. Anything else? Yes. There's one other trifling matter. As you saw, my megascope's acting up, in rather spectacular fashion. I'm certain there's an energy source nearby, generating disturbances, making the crystals malfunction. We must find it and neutralize it. Quickly, I must contact someone. It's urgent. All right. How do I find the source? Use this Potesta Quisitor. Potesta... Potesta Quisitor? Sounds fancy. Complicated. Yet it's ever so simple. Grasp it firmly, move it around, and the louder it squeals, the closer you are. Spare me your juvenile wit, please. Well, what are you waiting for? Ah, one more thing. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Geralt.
nothing here. Oh, got a signal. Signal's growing stronger. Can't be far now. Jennifer found a volunteer to walk around with that chirping stick after all. Shh. Ah, there you are. Disturbance is coming from there. What's in these crates? Dimeridium bombs. Lambert made them. No wonder the megascope doesn't work. All right, gotta get them out of here. I can do that. Rather you not make a mess of my shelves, just keep an eye on Uma. Yes, Uncle Vesemir. How goes it? Vesemir's not working you too hard, I hope. Uma. Thought so. All done. You can go. Now, let's check your conditioned reflexes. Nothing here. Hold this. What's this? Brewing potions? No. Booze from potato peels. Hmm. For my welcome back feast? Actually more like my farewell feast. Haven't heard? Madame Sorceress has requested I fortify the phylactery with power from the Circle of Elements. Says it's essential to lifting the curse from that monstrosity of yours. Don't sound too thrilled about all this. I'm not. You know the trek to the Circle's no walk in the park. In more ways than one. Let me go with you. Well, might have more spring in my step with the famous White Wolf at my side. So, you ready? No reason to wait. Let's go. Oh, meant to tell you- Nothing here. Look, like that? Pretty, isn't it? Interesting. Savola's Breach. Still haven't patched it up? Vesemir'd like to. Doesn't bother me, though. Not expecting anyone to lay siege, and... This way I got a shortcut to the pond. Shame those Salamander assassins didn't punch a few more holes in our walls. Or finish the job and reduce these ruins to rubble. Been thinking. We gonna swim across the pond? No, I got a boat moored there. You know, for fishing. Wow, never took you for the fishing type. I use bombs. I drop them in and scoop up whatever floats to the surface. <laughs> that makes sense. Shot. 
thing's almost a diversion attack. You gotta give me one. Show me what you got. Well, well. Color me impressed. Where'd you learn them tricks? It's an art. Learned it from this old master down in Zaracania. Yeah. Save that tale for your next sorceress. Tell me about Vesemir. Things any better between you? Seems so. Old man's dropped the moralizing, and I try not to piss him off too often. Mm -hmm. Working out well? Moderately. Castle's pretty big. Easy to stay out of each other's way. Damn it! I moored it right here, I swear! Line must have come loose. Really? Here I thought the boat untied itself to go for a jaunt on its own. In this fog, we'll never... There a storm before I arrived? Let me think. Yeah, five days passed. Mm. Wind must have grabbed the sail, tugged the boat off its mooring. Boat drifted into the bushes. Cave entrance is just opposite, see it? Gotta sail across the pond, go through the cave, climb Troll's head, and we're there. Doesn't seem like such an ordeal now, does it? No. Still gives me the shivers, though. You know only two boys returned from my group? You were the ones who ran into old Spear Tip in the caverns, right? Mm-hmm. Let's go. Jump in the boat. All right. I'm taking the tiller, though. Because? Cause it's my boat, not up for discussion. Make this boat yourself? Yeah. Something you don't like about it? Besides the water up to our ankles? Nothing. Quit whining. It'll make it across the lake. Provided we don't smash into something first. Barely see the tip of my nose. Fog's thick as curdled milk. Never took you for a poet. Oh, but I am one. Wanna hear a limerick? Sure. Lambert, Lambert, what a prick. Not bad.
fall off a bit. Sails fluttering. Don't teach your grandma to suck eggs. Right, almost there. Ready for the caverns? Almost. Before we go inside... Ugh, oh, drink a dose of cat, I know. Any more words of wisdom? Like, step softly or you'll wake old spear tip? Sheesh, you're pricklier than Yen. Ugh, oh, don't fall in love with me. Let's go. Ah! Hear that? Sounds like a kid. You know this valley's uninhabited except for us. It's gotta be an illusion. What if it's not? <sighs> Whatever you want to do. You're probably right. Let's go, straight to the cave. Finally, something reasonable. Not if I give you a boost. Remember? Part of the trials. A witcher is a lone hunter. But even a lone hunter can use a helping hand sometimes. Vesemir. Ready? Oh! You fat fuck! One, two, three! You're no feather either. Come on, let's go. Wall looks a little shaky. Hard make mine not stomping like that. Relax, I slip. Ah! What? Something fell in my eye. Splinter, I think. Hope it wasn't from a broken mirror. That'd make you even nastier. Ha ha. <laughs> Ugh. Place reeks of mold. What did you expect? Scent of violets? Would have been nice. Ah, so soft and sweet, just sleeping there. Makes you want to make this moment. Just lost the element of surprise. Couldn't care less. I'm up for the Probably. Let's get out of here. Wait. That's for Voltaire, you whore son. <laughs> you 
You finished? Let's move. Oh, good to be back above ground. Mm-hmm. Still trouble ahead. You mean the trolls? They're in for trouble, not us. Don't know who you're trying to impress. Tough guy stuff's just not working on me. <laughs> Look who's talking. Vesemir told me about that job you did for those Nilf guardians in Velen. What? What are you doing? Killing monsters. <laughs> Good one. Just came out that way. Come on. <laughs> 